Okay, hello everybody, it's me again. Uh, I'm making my third video uh, today. Because <laughs> I have a lot to talk about, I guess. Um, so, I bought this audio book called, uh, I can't remember now, something about productivity, the productivity uh, challenge or something like that. The author's name is Chris Bailey. He did a blog called uh, A Year of Productivity, and he also did a uh, 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 he's got a blog now called um, A Life of Productivity, and it's all about productivity. Uh, so, kind of listening to that right now, trying to think of uh, ways and methods for me to become more productive. Uh, and in my last video, I talked about a digital sabbatical. So, uh, and actually, uh, I made that decision about the uh, digital sabbatical in February. And uh, then I started listening to this audio book and... It, like the guy basically says, you know, uh, yeah, as many devices as you can turn off is that's it's only going to help your productivity. And he kind of went through um, kind of the whys on that, which is, I, you know, I knew there was a correlation between uh, internet usage and uh, uh, technology usage, that sort of thing, and, and attention span, right, and creativity, and uh, focus, all that stuff, because like in the, the pre-dawn times, uh, prior, uh, so I'm old enough that I can remember a time before the internet, and uh, although the internet existed, I'm talking about um, uh, like the public internet where it was widely in use and everyone had access to it. Uh, so <clears throat> prior to that, uh, I was, well, not exactly motivated. Like I wasn't an insanely motivated individual. I could get out of bed and do things, uh, go places, try new things, uh, do interesting stuff. Uh, and, uh, much less so now, you know? So, I started having a lot of mental issues. I think in my last video I mentioned that I'm seeing a therapist. And, uh, I could talk about that in a subsequent video. But, uh, so I've, I've had issues with depression and, uh, just, um, uh, focus and a hard, just difficult, you know, time. Uh, so, uh, and I, I don't remember as a kid, so there were some things as a kid, yeah, there was, like, some of the depression was there maybe, and, uh, some of these, like, were kind of under, under the radar kind of stuff, but I don't remember having, uh, attention problems, which is focus problems, which is like, um, I actually got diagnosed with attention deficit disorder. Although, I wonder if the attention deficit disorder that I was diagnosed with, first of all, everybody has attention deficit disorder, like everybody does. So, uh, but, uh, I, I don't remember having problems with uh, these mental problems until these technologies came around, like the internet. I even grew up mostly without TV. So, uh, I mean, I was in high school before I got a TV of my own. And even then, I only had three channels. So I mostly watched PBS. <laughs> um, and uh, really, I only had like two channels, PBS and ABC. Anyway. Uh, so, and then I get a VCR, I think the next year, 
and uh, so I started watching movies and stuff. Uh, but uh, and then when I went to college, obviously I got the internet, then I got cable, and so all these technologies got introduced and heaped on top, and uh, my attention just went to shit. Like, I can't concentrate for more than 15 seconds on any one particular topic, as you might be able to tell from uh, the way these videos go. So, uh, the rambling nature of these videos. Uh, so, uh, I'm a little bit excited about the digi digital sabbatical next uh, month, because I think it's going to give me an opportunity to kind of test myself to see uh, how my attention, what happens to my attention, and obviously it won't be 100% because my job is, um, I'm in IT, so I can't get away, <laughs> I can't get away from it, uh, but, um, so, f but in my off time, right, you know, I, uh, and even at work, right, so I can't, uh, I should be focusing in on what I'm doing and uh, a little bit more, hopefully, because I won't have these kind of distractions. Um, and I'm, I'm wanting to find out if uh, the, having this uh, time away from technology, or most of the technology, you know, is, uh, at least in my personal life, helps me be able to focus better, um, and get more things done that I actually want to do. Like, I used to write, and, um, uh, like, all the time, like, in high school, I wrote a lot of stuff, and, it was all, you know, terrible stuff. Like, it wasn't good. <laughs> it was something I enjoyed doing. And it was, like, kind of a creative act. And, uh, I want to I wanted see if I can get that back. You know what I mean? Like, if, uh, uh somehow, uh, so, for example, I haven't made any videos in a year. Right? And, uh. Um, so this past week, uh, I tried, I left my computer in the guest bedroom at the house and, uh, I, I left it laying there on the bed, like open and everything. Like I was using it and then I just laid it down there <laughs> and, uh, I was like, you know what? I'm not gonna, uh, I'm not gonna pick that thing back up for a while and see what happens. And already I feel better. Like I feel uh, and even though I've had my smartphone and I've still fucked around on it, uh, uh, I, I feel better somehow. So, uh, anyway, <laughs> there's that. I'm approaching my 10 minute limit on this, uh, phone here. I got about a minute and a half left. So, um, uh, in the future, so I've, I've made some videos here, and, uh, <laughs> so in the future, uh, for the next month, you know, I may not get a chance to get them uploaded, uh, or, uh, you know, uh, I may not upload videos for another month, because I'm kind of, and, and the phone I'm going to have, that I'm going to be using, does, you know, it's going to, I don't even know if it'll take videos, so, I'll have to see on that, what the status of that is. Uh, I don't know anything about the phone other than it's, it's, uh, it doesn't have all these crazy smartphone features. So, anyway. Uh, my time's winding down. So, I'll cut this video off right here. And uh, everyone have a great day.